All right, children, please do not try this at home. You're looking at Di Andrews, one of the world's best sword swallowers. He's also an escape artist, performer of mind and body demonstrations, and even better, he's local. He's located here in Baltimore, Maryland. Well, I uh, started off uh, as a little kid. Uh, I was always real interested in magic. Um, and uh, I got interested from magic into escape artistry because it was real. I enjoyed actually doing what I said I was doing instead of a magic trick where you're pretending. From escape artistry into different sideshow things, fire eating, and eventually sword swallowing and some of the other stuff that I do. And I guess really what it comes down to is uh, ever since I was a little kid, I always wanted superpowers, you know? Everybody wants it. I wanted to be Superman. I wanted to be Spider-Man. I wanted to be Batman. You know, I wanted to wanted to be able to do something really cool. And uh, somehow, I guess that just led me to where I am today. You can't find many people that swallow swords for a living. So when others see them do his act, they always have the craziest things to say. They're uh, they're shocked. They want to know why I wanted to do it, you know, what made me want to do it. Uh, sometimes uh, I even, you know, I even get some weird responses. I even got a guy who is tattooed from head to toe, face tattooed, implants, like all kinds of crazy stuff. And he looked at me and goes, you're crazy. I'd never do something like that. <laughs> I knew when a guy that was as unusual looking as he was, uh, who said I was, said I was crazy for doing what I was doing. I must be onto something. Di Andrews has some other talents with the sword as well. He knows how to use them in self-defense. And when he's not performing, he studies and teaches Xing Tuan, a form of Chinese Kung Fu. As an artist, I would like to be remembered as someone who made a real contribution to his art and who raised the level of and raised the standard uh, that is used to measure the quality of the performance of what I do. Um, I'd like to think that I take uh, a lot of art, a lot of activities, a lot of uh, feats and performances, whether they be traditional sideshow demonstrations or performances by Fakirs or Shaolin monks or the various uh, demonstrations that I do and add a new level of theatricality to them and uh, present maybe a little more emotional content and connect on a more artistic level than uh, what might have been seen in the past. Not too many people get the chance to live out their childhood dreams, but Di Andrews is one of the few that actually do. Growing up, he always wanted to have superpowers. Well, now he does, and it's with his swords.